<coughs> Hello, welcome back. I'm John, a old YouTuber. I'm just eating uh, this. I'm finished uh, for today, but this camp corner is finished charging. My other camp corner, this JBC, is charging uh, like 24 hours. When I wake up in the morning, it will still charging, so I cannot use this camp corner tonight. We have to use my 10 years old cannon. I did buy this second hand many years, seven years ago, but it can still record text like this. But I need a, <coughs> I need a minute or two to get ready because I uh, have to put the memory card back in my camcorder. Just made a video on Dennis. I was eating this bread. <coughs> made a video about how I pay my bills today. It's Thursday, the 1st December. I have paid my bills today and thousand dollars to my debts. So I have paid everything I need to pay. So I did uh, finish <coughs> upload all the Windows 10 and then think why not read the uh, Windows 11. So I have downloaded a fresh copy, a fresh copy of Windows 11. Then I found this one, Microsoft Windows version history, and about Microsoft uh, Windows and the Google Chrome web browser. I'm using that. Then I still need the Xeon CP Intel Xeon. <coughs> but that will take many days. <coughs> but that's not just some random I'm reading. I have it on my read list. That was Windows 10. I've just added uh, Windows 11, this PDF there, Google Chrome. I have it there. This I will read later when I'm finished reading this. I will read about this company, Lockheed Martin. Make this famous uh, Blackbird, SR71 Blackbird. This fighter jet could fly like three times the sound of the speeds. They are doing uh, another one, <coughs> but it's not ready. That's the new fighter aircraft. Denmark have five F-35 uh, Lightning. Denmark will get in a few years, so I'd like to read about it. I need a few PDF from this one. This page, we need a few uh, PDF. Then I have some other joy reading. <coughs> That's a computer game, game called Dota. Ikke Dota, Dota by Valve. That's something I did uh, then small PDF, but I'm not reading this PDF. I have my read again list. I have to add uh, Windows. We have to add uh, Windows 10. I'd like to read about Windows 10 again later. So let's add it to my list. So far it's uh, 7, <coughs> 7, 7.30 p.m. No Windows 10 should fit to this older Intel CPUs. <coughs> I can buy less uh, 10 dollars. On the Dennis uh, second hand called the blue papers, that's like the yellow papers. You can buy uh, Pentium 4, Pentium D, and Pentium dual core, quadruple core, just buy some old motherboards. I will make a video later about all my read list, <coughs> but it's not just some random, I have it. Uh, I need to have it because my computer is crashing. 
so when my computer is crashing I can find all this PDF again. <coughs> no, that's some uh, Intel Core 2 uh, CPUs I'm looking for second hand. I'm getting a motherboard, old uh, gamer motherboard with a Core 2 doing like I don't know it was 7200 or 7400. Actually, I'm getting a, <coughs> a motherboard with a old quarter core 9400. That's a high end uh, CPU for this NTA. All this they can run uh, Windows 10 because Windows 10 demands something called uh, NX bit or XD bit. But some of the, uh, the latest uh, <coughs> Pentium 4 press cards they have this NX bit or XD bit. They all have uh, uh, PAE and uh, SSE2, all uh, Pentium 4 have that, so Pentium 4 can run Windows 7. And this Pentium 4 Prescotts, but that's not all uh, Pentium 4 Prescotts, have uh, this NX bit or XD bits, but all properly they are much better, this one. But that's something I like to test in the future. To try to build some old uh, old computers with uh, Windows 10. You can actually use it for something because they have the the Microsoft uh, in, uh, I call it uh, Edge <coughs> in Edge Explorer. I not remember what they call it. I'm not using this. Uh, uh, this uh, Internet Edge uh, Web Explorer using the Google Chrome. So, uh, but if uh, Google Chrome can run on uh, Windows 7, if this Google Chrome can run to Windows 7, you can actually build a Pentium 4 computer with Windows 7 with uh, Google Chrome. But maybe this. Uh, Microsoft Edge uh, web browser uh, can run on Windows 7 but I read about in the last Windows 10 it mentioned and uh, the Windows 11 need uh, much much stronger hardware but Windows 11 should not uh, add so much new compared to uh, Windows 10 I was reading about that <clears throat> so I'm using uh, this computer have uh, Windows 11, this uh, old uh, Intel Core i5 8 generation. I have Windows 11 and I just got a very big update, took like half an hour, took more than half an hour downloads. So uh, this camcorder is not recording same quality as my other one, but I need to use what I have. Just use uh, what camcorder I have. We have uh, 60 minutes of power left, and I forgot <coughs> I need to eat my uh, bread. I have a Dennis video, I need to put my Dennis video public. Yes, I have a small piece of bread, but I can do that <coughs> in my bed. I have a small piece of bread I need to eat. But I need a minute to go back to my bed. Alarm put on. I have to check my... To check my cell phone. So I just charge my cell phone and listen, I have 91 power. So I'm ready for the weekends tomorrow. I have pay all my uh, bills for this month. I have plenty of food in my uh, deep freeze. I don't need to get out before Christmas. Just lay here and read uh, <coughs> read the uh, PDF. The next two weeks. Windows 11. 
Windows 11 version of the Windows NT operating system Windows 11 logo. Windows 11 desktop.png. Screenshot showing the new start menu and centered taskbar. 1. Developer Microsoft written ink. C++, C Sharp, assembly language. OS family Microsoft Windows source model closed source. Source available through shared source initiative. Some components open source, 2, 3, 4, 5. Released to manufacturing June 24, 2021. General availability October 5, 2021, 6. Latest release 22H2, 10.0.22621.900. The 29th of November 2022, 7. Plus or minus. Latest preview release preview channel. Windows 11 is the latest major release of Microsoft S Windows NT operating system, released in October 2021. It is a free upgrade to its predecessor, Windows 10, 2015, available for any Windows 10 devices that meet the new Windows 11 system requirements. Windows 11 features major changes to the Windows shell influenced by the cancelled Windows 10X including our designed start menu, the replacement of its live tiles with a separate widgets panel on the taskbar, the ability to create tiled sets of windows that can be minimized and registered from the taskbar as a group, and new gaming technologies inherited from Xbox Series X and series such as Auto HDR and direct storage on compatible hardware. Internet Explorer, i.e has been replaced by the Chromium-based Microsoft Edge as the default web browser like its predecessor, Windows 10, and Microsoft Teams is integrated into the Windows shell. Microsoft also announced plans to allow more flexibility in software that can be distributed via Microsoft Store, and to support Android apps on Windows 11, including a partnership with Amazon to make its App Store available for the function. Dot citing security considerations, the system requirements for Windows 11 were increased over Windows 10. Microsoft only officially supports the operating system on devices using an 8th generation Intel Core CPU or newer, with some minor exceptions, AMD Ryzen CPU based on Zen and microarchitecture or newer, or a Qualcomm Snapdragon 850 ARM system on chip or newer with UEFI Secure Boot and Trusted Platform Module, TPM, 2.0 supported and enabled, although Microsoft may provide exceptions to the TPM 2.0 requirement for OEMs. While the OS can be installed on unsupported processors, Microsoft does not guarantee the availability of updates. Windows 11 removed its support for 32-bit x86 CPUs and devices which use BIOS firmware. Windows 11 received a mixed reception at launch. Pre-release coverage of the operating system focused on its stricter hardware requirements, with discussions over whether they were legitimately intended to improve the security of Windows or as a ploy to upsell customers to newer devices and over e-waste associated with their changes. Upon release, it was praised for its improved visual design, window management, and a stronger focus. Yes, <clears throat> I had to reboot my computer before the auto-reading works. I'll not do that now. I forgot to do that, I'll do that later. 22H2, 10.0.22621.900, November 29, 2022, 8, 9, plus or minus, beta channel 22H2, 10.0.22623.1020, November 28, 2022, 10, plus or minus, Dev channel 10.0.25252.1000, the 28th of November 2022, 11, plus or minus, 
marketing target personal computing tablets available in 110 languages, 12, 13, list of languages Afrikaans, Albanian, Amharic, Arabic, Armenian Assamese, Azerbaijani, Bangla, Bangladesh, Bangla, India, Basque, Belarusian, Bosnian Bulgarian, Catalan, Central Kurdish, Cherokee Chinese, Simplified, Chinese, Traditional, Croatian, Czech, Danish, Dari Persian, Afghanistan, Dutch, German, Greek, English, United Kingdom, English, United States, Estonian, Finnish, Filipino, French, Canada, French, France, Galician, Georgian, Gujarati Hausa, Hebrew, Hindi, Hungarian, Icelandic, Igbo Indonesian, Irish, Italian, Japanese, Kannada Kazakh, Khmer, Kh, Kinyarwanda, Konkani Korean, Kyrgyz, Lao, Latvian, Lithuanian Luxembourgish, Macedonian, Malay, Malayalam Maltese, Murari, Marathi, Mongolian, Nepali. On security, but was criticized for various modifications to aspects of its user interface which were seen as worse than its predecessor. As of October 2022, Windows 11, at 15%, 15, and up to 16%, in the US, 16, or more in some countries, 17, is the 2nd most popular Windows release on Windows PC, 18 while Windows 10 is still by far most popular with 5.5 the market share of its successor, and also 6.5 the share of Windows 7. Windows 11 is ahead of Windows 7, but after Windows 10 which stands at 72% globally, and 77% in the United States. 19. Across all platforms Windows 11 runs own a share of 4.0% of PCs. Contents. Development Announcement Release and Marketing Features User Interface Windows Subsystem for Android System Security Versions Supported Languages Available Languages System Requirements Platform Firmware compatibility. Third party software. Reception per release. Launch. See also. References. External links. Development. At the 2015 Ignite conference, Microsoft employee Jerry Nixon stated that Windows 10 would be the last version of Windows, a statement that Microsoft confirmed was reflective of its view. 20, 21. The operating system was considered to be a service, with new builds and updates to released over time. 22. Northern Soto, Norwegian Bukmal, Norwegian Lunorsk, Adia, Persian, Iran, Punjabi, Gomuki, Punjabi, Sharmukhai, Polish, Portuguese, Brazil, Portuguese, Portugal, Quechua, Romanian Russian, Scottish Gaelic, Serbian, Cyrillic, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Serbian, Cyrillic, Serbia, Serbian, Latin, Sindhi, Arabic. Sinela, Slovak Slovenian, Spanish, Argentina, Bolivia, Chile Colombia, Costa Rica, Ecuador, Dominican Republic, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras Latin American, Mexico, Panama, Paraguay, Peru, Puerto Rico, Spain, Uruguay, Venezuela, Swahili, Swedish, Tajik, Tamil, Tata, Telugu, Thai Tigrinya, Swana, Turkish, Turkmen, Ukrainian Urdu, Uya, Uzbek, Valencian, Vietnamese Welsh, Wolof, Corsa, Yoruba, Zulu Update Method Windows Update. Microsoft Store. Windows Server Update Services, SIS. Package Manager.exe, APPX, Apps Bundle and APK based platforms X86 64, ARMV 8.1, 14, K 
kernel type hybrid, Windows End Kernel, Userland Native API Windows API.net Framework Universal Windows Platform Windows Subsystem for Android Windows Subsystem for Linux Default ASA Interface Windows Shell, Graphical, preceded by Windows 10, 2015. Official website u.microsoft.com forward slash windows forward slash windows 11 support status C versions for more details. In October 2019, Microsoft announced Windows 10X, a future edition of Windows 10 designed exclusively for dual touchscreen devices such as the then upcoming Surface Neo. It featured a modified user interface designed around context-sensitive postures for different screen configurations and usage scenarios, and changes such as a centered taskbar and updated start menu without Windows 10s live tiles. Legacy Windows applications would also be required to run in containers to ensure performance and power optimization. Microsoft stated that it planned to last Windows 10X devices by the end of 2020. 23, 24, 25, in May 2020, during the COVID-19 pandemic. Panos Pane, Microsoft's chief product officer for Microsoft Windows and Microsoft Office, stated that as we continue to put customers' needs at the forefront, we need to focus on meeting customers where they are now, and announced that Windows 10X would only launch on single-screen devices at first, and that Microsoft would continue to look for the right moment, in conjunction with our OEM partners, to bring dual-screen devices to market. 26, 27, in October, 2020. Reports emerged that Microsoft was working on a user interface refresh for Windows 10 codenamed Sun Valley, scheduled to be included in a late 2021 feature update codenamed Cobalt. Internal documentation stated that the aim for Sun Valley was to reinvigorate e, the Windows user interface and make it more fluid with a more consistent application of WinUI while reports suggested Microsoft planned to adapt U elements seen in Windows 10X.28, in January 2021, it was reported that a job listing referring to a sweeping visual rejuvenation of Windows had been posted by Microsoft.29. By December 2020, Microsoft had begun to implement and announce some of these visual changes and other new features on Windows 10 Insider Preview builds, such as new system icons, which also included the replacement of shell resources dating back as far as Windows 95, 30, improvements to task view to allow changing fuel paper on each virtual desktop, x86-64 emulation on ARM, and adding the Auto HDR feature from Xbox Series X.31, 32, 33, on the 18th of May, 2021, head of Windows Servicing and Delivery John Cable stated that Windows 10X had been cancelled and that Microsoft would be accelerating. The integration of key foundational 10x technology into other parts of Windows and products at the company. 34. Announcement At the Microsoft Build 2021 Developer Conference, CEO and Chairman Satya Nadella teased about the existence of the next generation of Windows during his keynote speech. According to Nadella, he had been self-hosting it for several months. He also teased that an official announcement would come very soon. 35. Just a week after Nadella's keynote, Microsoft started sending invitations for a dedicated Windows Media event at 11 MET on the 24th of June, 2021. 36, 37. Microsoft also posted an 11-minute video of Windows Startup Sounds Toy YouTube on the 10th of June, 2021. 
with many people speculating both the time of the Microsoft event and the duration of the Windows startup sound video to be a reference to the name of the operating system as Windows 11. 38, 39, on the 24th of June, 2021. Windows 11 was officially announced at a virtual event hosted by Chief Product Officer Panos Payne A.40, 41, 42. According to Nadella, Windows 11 is a reimagining of the operating system. 43. Further details for developers such as updates to the Microsoft Store.